I've got no coin. If you want some, I'll give it you. And team, the season is here now. You might want to go to fifcoins.com and use that code HABIT to get yourself 8% off. There's a link in the description. Go get your coins. Well then boys and welcome to a team of the season, Januzovic review. This guy is an absolute beast. Before we get into this review, if we get it 75 plus likes, that'd be absolutely amazing. You guys are killing the sport right now. And if you are new around here, hit that subscribe button just below as there'll be team of the season reviews all week. And I think there's going to be a goalkeeper next, which is very interesting as I've never reviewed a goalkeeper. So... In, uh, sorry, Team of the Season, Januzovic. As you can see, this is the team I put him in. He's got Team of the Season, Farming in goal, so it kind of gives away my next uh, review. Uh, so let's have a look at his card. He's 82 rated. I put him in the centre forward. He's got 84 pace, 85 dribbling, 80 shot, 84 passing, 80 physical and 72 defending. High, high work rates, four star week for three star skills, and in five games he scored me seven goals and got three assists. Out of those five games, two of them were rage quits, and I won the other three. He absolutely annihilated, lad. 69 in-game strength, 99 stamina, 99 balance. He's also got uh, 83 ball control, 81 crossing, 87 curve, 82 dribbling, 75 uh, finishing. He's also got stats like 82 long shots, 84 shot power, 86 short pass. He can play centre mid, cam at CDM or left mid. He's 27, he's 5 foot 8 and he's also got the uh, engine and acrobat specialities. So straight away you're going to notice he's pretty weak in game. 69 strength is not actually a very good strength to have. But his balance does keep him on the pitch, like, uh, sorry, on his feet, should I say, very easily. And I very much like that about him. He's so good. He's basically, you know how Lionel Messi, he stays on his feet a lot when he gets like put into uh, challenges with defenders. And that's because of his balance um, and his high dribbling. And that is something that Januzovic is very, very good at, high dribbling. He has got a very decent dribbling stat. And for 85 dribbling... Honestly, it felt more like 90 dribbling. He was very, very good on the ball. He took around all the defenders with absolute ease. He's got 84 pace, which is actually very good for beating defenders. I felt that he was extremely quick rather than 84 pace. I felt like he had more like 88 pace maybe because he beat all the defenders and the right back and left backs. Now, one thing I did notice that was kind of bad about him was his passing. His passing wasn't fantastic. His crossing was amazing, but his passing wasn't fantastic. Now, I didn't really like his uh, three balls, even though he's got a high passing stat, I didn't like his three balls, his crossing, don't get me wrong, he could cross a ball very well, and he assisted my players, I think, twice or three times, three crosses, and I actually really like that about him, but his passing... Short range was okay, long range not very good at all, which doesn't help because he's got high high work rates and he comes back a lot during the game. So he needs to put those over the top through balls to the right wing and left wingers and he just isn't doing that amazingly. But apart from that he's a very good all round centre forward, I'd recommend you play him in cam though as he's got those high high work rates, he tracks back a lot and he plays more like a centre mid most of the time. But if you play him in a cam in a 4-1-2-1-2, I reckon he'd be a great addition to your side. The only problem is... Is he worth 40 to 60k? Now he's not selling for 40,000 coins. He's good for that price, but there's so many better cams you can get in the Bundesliga for cheaper. If you enjoyed this review, leave a like down below. I'll give him a 9.5 out of 10. Anyway, lads, it's been Hey, you guys are fantastic, and I'll see you lads later.